All right, guys, we are here in Redwood City and they just dropped, the Tesla team just dropped the V4 cabinets. All right, so what do we have here? We have the V4 cabinets and these, what is unique about these is the fact that they are, their output, they can hold up to eight stalls simultaneously now instead of the four in the V3s. This is a lot smaller, um, the actual build size of this is a lot smaller than the V3s. And they also don't have a lot of the stuff around it that uh, would cover them up. They're just part of the, the charging experience now. So what does this mean? This means that Tesla will be able to put out more chargers cost efficiently, more, more productive, because now you're able to handle up to eight stalls with just one of these. So imagine just like they have, I think it's gonna, clearly it's gonna be like 16 stalls here. They opened up eight today, but you would have needed four of these instead of the two. Tesla is just milking every single dollar that they can. And also too, this can do up to a thousand kilowatts. And obviously my Cybertruck, if it was at like 0% can do up to 500 kilowatts. Um, and so this allows for the next 10 to 15 years, they have the technology now uh, that they'll be able to build these, these sites uh, that can literally go up to a thousand kilowatts once the technology goes there. And the battery charging makes, makes sense. We know that Tesla has uh, specifically BYD or one of the other Chinese companies has put out some tests of hitting a thousand kilowatts. They had two cords nonetheless, but this station can now do it. From what I've heard, that would actually destroy the battery if you kept doing that. So Tesla is going to put out something where it actually makes sense uh, from a battery longevity perspective to, to do this. So I just wanted to do that. I got some you know, more, more information from the amazing Tesla charging team and uh, again, it's just everything they do, they're trying to get as much efficiency as possible. So pretty, pretty cool. They never settle, that's the thing. Get comfortable with being uncomfortable is literally the motto. All right, guys, we are here in Redwood City and they just dropped, the Tesla team just dropped the V4 cabinets um if you remember in los gatos they actually had dropped the three and a half cabinets that was like the first one 325 kilowatts but what is special about these v4 uh well let me tell you first off this can literally hold a thousand kilowatts of dc fast charging um and this is the first one here in Redwood City. And here are some of the other stats, okay? You can, right now on the Cybertruck, you can literally get 500 kilowatts of charging. Um, you could also, it's three times the power density along with two times the stalls per cabinet. So again, they haven't released these yet. And I just heard that if you're at like 0%, you will be able to charge from zero to 44% in 15 minutes. That is just uh, pretty crazy, um, but also pretty exciting. So I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, put this on the charger over here. Um, I'm only at 63%, so it's kind of, a, kind of a bummer. It's not gonna be like a true test here. So let's get this, this going. It's open, I'm gonna plug that in. Um, but yeah, this is just super, super cool. Tesla is always just working so hard to make sure that they are constantly ahead of the game. So again, today, this is only gonna charge up to 500 kilowatts if I'm at like one or 2% or 0% or whatever it is. Um, and it has to be preconditioned. But the big thing is, is that they, this has the capabilities, these V4 have the capabilities of going up to a thousand kilowatts. So, um, you know, again, they're just staying on, on top of it. Uh, they obviously aren't releasing that, but as this gets further out, so here, let's just step into my car real quick. So I'm only drawing right now about 89 kilowatts, but again, I'm at 63%. So I'm gonna have to come back here and charge it faster, but um, yeah, it's pretty cool either way, nonetheless. Um, super cool also too to see 
the whole charging team out here um, along with, um, they're just hosting some, they're gonna be doing test drives and hosting some coffee and good vibes because the announcement just went out. Um, so yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool. You know, uh, Wes and Max were out here um, in Jackson. So just a lot of cool things going on, but yeah, this is the V4 cabinet launch. And if you are at a low state of charge, you will be able to get to 500 kilowatts and eventually they can open it up to a thousand kilowatts once uh, the vehicles or whatever else needs to be charging.